have you seen these mosquitoes lately? They seem to be getting larger and larger. Now, you look at it this way. You see these freaking buggers? Oh, I'm freaking nuts! Ah, get the fuck away from me! Get the fuck away from me! Your bro comes in, sees this thing right on you, and he's like, What the heck is that? What the heck is that? You're going, Get this fucking thing off me! Get it off me! He starts wailing on you. Whacking, whacking. And you're like, Get the fucking newspaper! This thing is not gonna come on! You're making it redder! Gets the newspaper. Whack! Keeps whacking her arm where this freaking mosquito is. And then you're like, fuck, it's not on me anymore. It's on you. He grabs the freaking newspaper, you whack it right on his arm. The mosquito finally dies. You look at the newspaper where the mosquitoes went swatted, and it's freaking a good two inches. Where's the size? What the heck is the scientist or the ecosystem doing to these bugs? They're freaking growing out of control. Now, you work at a grocery store or anywhere like that, and you know how customers can meet. There's three types. There's the common. The one that just goes in, tries to get like a thing of like toothpaste or something like that or soda. Well, here's them with their cart. They go, they're walking by, and they're like, hey, where can I find the soda at? Aisle 13, man. Aisle 13. Now, the average customer that comes in daily. They're going, just going and going. You're asking, hey, can I help you with anything? Customer's like, no, nah, I basically live here, man. I know where everything is. Then you got the crazy kooks. Now, where the sun visors, or not even that. But they'll have, like, the craziest things. They won't pay attention to the rules. And they'll be cussing out at everybody at every weekend. That, no. They'll be smoking in the stores when nobody, when everybody knows automatically, you're not supposed to smoke in any grocery stores or any stores. So, here they are. Sun visor, glasses, cigarette in their mouth, lit. They're going by the store, like just walking in the store, swinging their bag around, cussing, saying, Fucking mill around my way. I want my damn chicken. I want my damn chicken. Get out of my way. I want my damn chicken. I want it now. Well, when this person comes down to the register, you know something bad's going to happen. So here you are. If you're a bagger, you know all about this. They're coming into the line. You're getting ready to bag your groceries. And they go and say, right as soon as you look into their eyes, they're, they're going to be like, don't look in my eyes, pervert. Don't look in my eyes. And you're just like, okay, okay. You keep bagging. Then you go and try again. Oh, so how's your day going? Get those nasty perverted eyes off my eyes and get, get your freaking mind out of here. 
your guests quickly, bag groceries, put them in their car, and here's what you say. I have a great day, ma'am. You're walking up past, the lady's going saying, what did that pervert say to me? Now, there's the other kind. They expect you to help them out. You help them out, what do they do? They go and say, don't, don't bust anything, don't squish anything. Just place it carefully in my car. And don't smash my donuts. I said, don't smash my donuts. So you're placing it into their car. All nice and neat, gentle and everything. And the next thing the customer says is, You didn't squish my donuts, did you? You didn't squish my donuts. They're the most precious thing to me. And you're like, Nah, here's your donuts. Have a great day. Walk away.